If you guys are looking for the cheapest coins on the internet right now, make sure to check out my brand new sponsor, MMO EXP. They have the cheapest coins that you can find anywhere on the internet. Use code Poodle at checkout for 5% off your order. What's going on everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team Video Guide. And today, we got a brand new pack in the store. Fan Appreciation Packs 2. Like I told you guys, they were coming at us with another Fan Appreciation Pack. Now, initially, we thought it was going to be just the ones reset. And then, later in the week, they did announce they were announcing the two packs. Now, how much better could this pack get? I wasn't entirely sure, but guys, they boosted them quite a bit, and I'm very excited they did so. Makes it a lot more fun to open these packs now, especially with the more guaranteed odds. Now, guys, for all you guys wondering about Mutt Rewards, I will cover that shortly throughout this video. I will cover that in just a second. But guys, before we get into the video, I'm going to be opening up all the packs available in the store for fan appreciation. I really feel strong about a golden ticket. Guys, comment down below right now, GT Luck. I've been trying to pull a golden ticket. I've been, okay, first off, I haven't pulled anything all year, like nothing good. No LTDs, no nothing. Now would be the time. I mean, would I consider 99 Vic and LTD? Not exactly, but it would be something. Now, guys, the odds in these packs are really good. I do feel pretty great. I, I feel pretty good about opening these packs, quite honestly. I think I have a high chance of getting something. But, guys, before we get into today's video, make sure you go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn the notification bell, boys, come join the family. And if you're new to the channel and maybe you're kind of dying off of Madden, it's fine. Subscribe now. You won't regret it. We'll have great content in Madden 21, which is only like two months from now. So hit that sub button, turn on that notification bell, boys, come join the family. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys got out of these packs. Now, let's head on over now. For all you guys wondering about Mutt Rewards, guys, as far as Mutt Rewards go, they are coming out approximately 4 p.m. Eastern time. So remember, I showed you guys yesterday, if you're a pro member, if you're like a rookie, you get like the old fan appreciation packs. I think if you're like a pro, you get a, well, you get two fan old fan appreciation packs. If you're like a whatever after pro, you get one and one. And if you're the top tier, you get two new ones. So hopefully you guys are the top tier. So I will be getting two free ones later, which I will be opening in tomorrow morning's video. And then right now I'm going to be opening up these now. Let's hop into the first pack. Before we do, it contains one 93 plus overall lead player. So that's solid. A 93 plus every single pack is guaranteed. So that means you're going to be guaranteed like getting full ultimate legend pulls, maybe GTs. There's two 86 pluses, which is, you can still hit in those spots. And two 82 pluses, which means you can still hit in those spots. Now review info. The chance of a 93 plus is 100% of course. The chance of a 96 plus is above 50% actually, which is super solid, which means almost every other pack you're going to be pulling at least an ultimate legend or some kind of full... Um, player at some point like some some top player and then the chance of you pulling a 98 plus which pretty much does imply a full ultimate legend like a 99 legend or a golden ticket or 98 plus so i'm super excited to open these packs don't get me wrong it's very tempting to spend money on these because i really want to pull some but i gotta refrain from doing so because we are later in the year at this point it would be kind of useless to actually spend real money let's hop into the first pack see what these odds are looking like so oh good okay yeah we could have saw that one coming hold let me hop back into the store try opening them again are people really spamming them that bad a issue has occurred. Okay, good. So these packs aren't gonna work. Let's back out of Ultimate Team real quick. I wonder if I wonder if we're all having these same problems. Comment down below if you guys are having these same problems right now. It'd be interesting to know if it's not working for anyone. Because I do want to open these packs. I'm, I was actually very excited to that whole intro. I was looking forward to opening it. I did not expect that to not work. But okay, let's go back in now. Ultimate Team seems like it's lagging right now. I mean, it'd be weird for it not to be working. All right, let's try this again. Okay, there we go. Packs are opening now. Perfect. I should have back out. Okay, so first spot, we get a theme builder, 87 Cody Ford. So that's probably the 86 plus slot. Okay, so we still got the 93 plus. We got a heavyweight. That's probably an 86 plus as well. Okay, so our 86 plus are out of the way. Another heavyweight. That's an 82 plus more than likely. All right, we got a full ultimate legend, 97 auto Graham. Okay, that's really not bad. Honestly, like the only issue with this right now is that things are going to be... Oh, guys, the mark's going to crash real bad after these. But full legend, guys, that's my first full ultimate legend for the entire year, which is very 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 sad honestly card's not great but not bad let's see what he's going for at this moment in time he's probably crashing real bad just want to check because i do know the market's gonna crash bad guys we're probably gonna have the worst market crash this year like it only gets worse and worse that's got to be up there for one of the worst though because we do know that this is going to kill everything which is why hopefully you guys sold a good amount of your team before you ended up you know getting to today yeah he's 59k oh god i'm gonna wait i'm not gonna sell these things right now I'm gonna let things come back up because I do know this is about to get real bad. But on the bright side, I could probably sell them for around 60, 70k. So that means I did make money on that pack, which is not bad, guys. These packs are probably gonna be guaranteed profit once things come back up in price a little bit. Because that 96 plus is gonna probably be at least 40 to 50k every single time, bare minimum. Okay, so we get a theme builder right here. 85, so that's our 82 plus right there. We get a draft player, I believe. Ooh, 97 Leonard Williams. That's not that bad, actually. But. I don't know if that was our best player, which would really suck if it was. Yep, it was. Okay, so that's not bad, though. Again, I think I'm making coins here. 
I need to, okay, I have three left. We have, we have still have a chance to pull the guy I'm trying to pull here. All right, an 85 John Elway. Full legend, 89 marks out in the GOAT. Hopefully you guys haven't forgot about him just yet. <clears throat> the greatest card in Madden history. Series Redux, Lamar Jackson, 93 Le'Veon Bell, okay. Another full ultimate legend, give me Vic. 98 John Randall. All right, that's not that bad actually. That's pretty good. Okay, we got two more. Golden ticket, that's what we need. We need that golden ticket flash, the whole gears and all. I don't even care which one it would be. If it was an old one, if it was a new one, I really don't care. Just give me a golden ticket. That That's a good one, I think, right? 95 Weston Richburg. That is not, oh, is that a 93 plus though? That would suck. 92 at two tall Jones. We get a flashback right here. 90 to Mario Davis. Oh God, that was a bad pack. We're on to our last one, which kind of does suck. Uh, if that was it, if that's all we pulled. I got, guys, I feel like we gotta get a golden ticket at some point. It's just never gonna happen. We got a veteran here. Please be a low one. 90 Lat Murray. All right, full legend. 88 Anthony, no, not full legend. Full ultimate legend though, Michael Vick. 97 Andre Reed Redux flashback. Oh God. Okay. Okay, guys. These packs on paper are great, but at the end of the day, we still can't pull anything. We have no luck. We have absolutely no luck. I don't know what it is with my account. I just I, I can't I can't pull anything. Nothing of value. John Randall, what are you going for? 139k. Yeah, I mean I, I made double a pack on him though. That's really that's really not too bad. Maybe I will sell him real quick. Just get some guaranteed profit back in case the market just permanently die. So let's toss him up real quick. Okay, John Randall wasn't bad. I mean, I mean, I did pull some good stuff, not gonna lie. Like, I pulled decent stuff, considering what it could have been even worse than that. But, like, I was really hoping I would have gotten, like, I just, a golden ticket. I don't know what I gotta do for a golden ticket. I, I've tried my hardest. I mean, I can't spend every coin I have for real, but. Okay, so I make. So, pretty much any pack I pulled 97 on, I'm going to make more money on once I add all the other players into it. So, it's really not too bad overall. So, guys, if you have any better luck than me, like, even the slightest bit, you're going to be making a decent amount of coins, or at least breaking even, which, breaking even on packs is fun, because if you break even on packs, that means that you gave yourself a chance to pull a great player, and if you don't pull a golden ticket, you get your money back. Like, I, you really just never can complain with, a, like, that, that, you just, you can't complain when you get your money back, in my opinion, in packs, because when you open packs, you're looking for that big guy, and then the, the consequence for not pulling the big guy is you lose coins. But if you can make your coins back, you took your chance, you made your coins back, no harm, no foul, in, in essence. So, I really do not mind that idea. Now, guys, would I recommend you open them? Honestly, yes. I think they're good packs. Like I just said, I pretty much made my coins back. I might have even made some coins when they were all, all said and done, if I sell everything properly. So, they weren't bad, considering I think I had pretty bad packs and I still made coins. So, a lot of you guys are probably going to pull golden tickets. If you, any of you pull a golden ticket, please tweet it at me on Twitter. I would I'll retweet it. It'll be interesting to see how many of you guys actually pull golden tickets out of these. But remember, with the market going to be dying right about now, let's go check those out. All right, auto gram so really quick. With the market just absolutely probably crashing, you will be able to get some pretty good deals and some players. So make sure you go check that out. If you guys have a lot of coins and you're not a pack guy, do what I usually do when I'm not when I care about coins a lot. I don't actually participate in packs. I just buy the players cheaper that are now in packs. So let's go check out the golden tickets first and foremost. It's probably down a lot. Let's see golden tickets. Yep, Keith Bullock is 700k for a golden ticket, guys. He's not that bad. I assure you, he's not that bad. Mike Evans is super cheap. Reggie Jalen Ramsey's 1.3. Ooh, I actually might buy that. Get him and then get Michael Vick. Cam Newton super cheap. Okay, Cam Newton's not that bad either. Where's Where's Lamar Jackson? All right, Lamar, you're coming home for free though. Okay, Michael Vick's getting pretty cheap too. Okay, this is pretty crazy, guys. I don't know if golden tickets are crashing now though, or is it just like? They were already that bad. I, I, I don't know. I mean, these are newly posted, so it could be. Let's go check out before we close this video. Michael Vick. Let's see. Wow, Jim Brown right there. Michael Vick, Michael Vick, Michael Vick, Michael Vick. Okay, I could be wrong, but Michael Vick's probably in the 200k range. 249k for Michael Vick. I'm actually going to buy that. It's a snipe, right? Yeah, I, I think I'm pretty sure it's a snipe. Not bad at all right there. 249k. I took quite a while to buy that, though. Not a bad card. I'm going to hold on to that. I'll either sell it later for 300k again, or I'll keep it. I don't really know. I'll see what I do with that. But guys, better for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you are into the channel, make sure you go down below. Hit that subscribe button. Turn that on bell, boys. Come join the family. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, as always. And if you haven't already, comment down below, guys. Let me know what you pull out of these packs. I want to know what you guys pull out of these packs. If you pull any golden tickets, please tweet them at me. I will retweet them on Twitter. 
please i want to see what the odds are of pulling them because i can't pull any i cannot pull something to save my life no ltds or nothing the closest thing i've gotten to an ltd ever was that andre reed uh, redux i just pulled because i think he was an ltd so it's about it that i've really pulled but guys about it for the video hope you enjoyed i'm out peace